Hello, it's Josh from Server Pro here, and today we'll be setting up a web server with Nginx on your VPS. Nginx is a popular high performance web server and reverse proxy, which many users prefer over alternatives like Apache because of its quick page render times and low memory consumption. This makes it perfect for both small and large websites and can be scaled accordingly. Nginx has support for HTML, PHP, Python, Ruby, and many other languages, so no matter what your website or web application is written in, Nginx can almost certainly handle it. In this video, we'll just be covering the setup process for static HTML websites, but keep your eyes out for a video covering the configuration of PHP FPM so you can use content management systems like WordPress and Joomla. To set up Nginx, open your Server Pro account and navigate to the control panel for the server that you wish to modify. Next, open the Create Service tab and select Nginx under Service. If you just want to use the subdomain that we have set up for you, in this case, serverpro-vps-tutorials.myserver.js, you don't need to make any further changes, just click Install. If you want to use a custom domain for your website, firstly you're going to need to create an A record pointing to your VPS or your DNS provider. Click the I or the link in the description for details on how to set up DNS. In this case, I'm using Cloudflare. Create a new A record and enter at under name, enter your VPS's IP address under IPv4 address, and toggle the proxy status to DNS only by clicking on the cloud icon, then click save. You may also want to point www.yourdomain.com to your web server. In this case, add a new C name record enter www under name and your domain name under target. Once again, toggle the proxy status to DNS only and click save. Now that we've got DNS configured, head back over to your VPS, select the Nginx service from the service switcher and navigate to the files tab. Then open the nginx.conf file. In the file, find the server directive and append the host names that you want to use to the line. In this case, I'm adding serverproteam.com and www.serverproteam.com. Lastly, save the file and restart the service. In this default setup, Nginx will be able to load HTML files and any CSS and JavaScript files that are sourced therein. To manage our website files, navigate to the Files tab and open the Public directory. In this folder, you can create and upload as many files as you wish. I'm just going to create an index.html file that will be loaded by default when we visit our website. Now all you need to do is open a new tab, enter your domain and hit enter and you'll be greeted by your website. If you've enjoyed the video make sure to hit that like button, subscribe and click the notification bell to ensure that you don't miss future videos from Server Pro. If you need help contact our support team. I've been Josh, cheers.